this is Paul from Guitar World, and right here I have the brand new Crank Amplifiers Crank Rev Junior. Now let's get right to it. Crank makes some of the best hard rock and heavy metal amplifiers in the business. If you already own a wonderful Krankenstein or the fantastic sounding Revolution, the Crank Rev Junior is the next best thing. It's great, especially if you're a recording guitarist or if you're just a bedroom guitarist. Right over here, you can have a crank right by your side to give you all those heavy and hard rock tones. So let's take a closer look at this great sounding amp. The Crank Rev Junior is a 20 watt powerhouse of an amplifier. It employs two 6L6 tubes to give you that crushing metal sound that Crank is known for. It is essentially a two channel amp with a Crank clean channel and of course the Crank gain channel. It has some of the controls or one of the controls that you're very familiar with if you already own a Crank which is the sweep control which basically gives you a bit of a parametric EQ. It has its bass mid-range treble it has a master and it also has a dual knob which acts as the main volume for the clean channel and then the knob for the gain channel on the gain side of things. Or I should say on the gain channel over here. There's also a boost switch on this and then of course the channel switch which allows you to toggle between both the clean channel and the gain channel, the crank channel I should say. There's also an effects loop with a level control and then the crank cabinets as you can see over here, are very cool. It has the, you know, the same crank metal, metal grill that we all come to know and love. And the cabinets employ a Eminence Legend V12 speaker in both, which really is a great sounding speaker. Let's begin with the crank channel on the Rev Junior. Now, right out of the box, this amp sounds great. And just send it, setting the controls pretty much flat, as you can see up here, I have them pretty close to about noon, and the master is, you know, conservatively set here at about 9 o'clock, because I said it gets pretty loud. But let's hear what this sounds like just at a very simple EQ setting. Here we go. Now, keeping the same setting that I just had before, the, you can add even more gain on top of this amp by just simply engaging the boost switch, and that really adds a nice, uh, a nice dose of gain on top of it. So here's what it sounds like without the boost switch, and then I'll kick it in, and you can really hear how much uh, distortion is on tap. Here we go. <laughs> So let's stick on the crank channel and let me show you how the sweep control works and I'm not going to engage the boost, I'll just leave it off for now and I'll start rotating this sweep control so you really get to hear the range of tones. Here we go. Also on the crank channel, uh, let's hear how much gain you get just by moving the gain knob. Right now I have it about 3 o'clock, which is almost 3 quarters of the way. 
So you can hear a range of gain sounds without activating the boosts. So let's hear what that sounds like. Simply by moving the EQ controls, you can also get some really alternate uh, heavy metal sounds. What I'm going to do here is I'll crank the bass, pull the mid-range about here, leave the sweep in the middle, and cut the treble to about halfway, and I'm engage the boost. Let's hear what that sounds like. <laughs> Now let's move over to the crank clean channel. Now, one thing you got to keep note of is because that the gain knob and the clean volume channel share the same knob, when you switch over to the clean, and if you used to like to use a lot of gain, you're really loud. I'll show you what I mean. Like, here's my volume on my crank channel. And now I'm going to switch over to the clean because I have it really loud. And so you're really loud over there. So you might want to come down on it. And to, in order to get a nice clean out of this amplifier. So let's hear what the clean channel sounds like. So as you heard, that's the clean channel. It's very nice, extremely mid-rangey. Actually, it sounds a lot like a vintage amp and responds the same way. And the great thing about this channel is that you can turn it up, as you heard me before, and you can get an alternate type of uh, classic rock sound on this channel. So here's the clean again. And as I turn it up, it just starts to get all overdriven. Let's take a listen. Last but not least, let's go back to the crank channel. And because of its wattage at 20 watts, this thing starts to feed back quickly. So it gets a nice musical feedback. So let me uh, 
Let it rip. Let's hear what the feedback sounds like. Here we go. Crank Rev Jr. gets the gold award because it's affordable and a fantastic sounding tube amplifier. It may be the ultimate heavy metal bedroom amplifier. It's also great for recording because it provides metal tones and hard rocking tones. If you're looking for the sound of a stack but at more than half the power, the Crank Rev Jr. is the way to go. Check it out. <laughs>